Hey there, friends! Welcome back to Divinity Original Sin 2. I am Lazy Bones. And on the last episode, uh, it's getting really close, getting really, really, really close. We kicked his butt. <laughs> Nothing special. And check out Bambi here. Mm, best don't go. You saved us just in time. That's how I imagine him talking. Bambi, you. That's why you didn't talk in the movie because you sound like that. Anyway, if you were drawn here... The altar lies in silence, glowing faintly with a familiar, comforting warmth. You get some source! FYI. Just, you know... If you have no slots of source in there, you'll get a source. At least that's what I think, because that's what it tell told me, but I already had a source in there, so I didn't really get anything, so... <laughs> I'm not lying at all. It, it, that's what it said. You get source. Well, not in those words, but you, you know what I mean. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Where are we going? I don't know. We're just gonna explore, walk around, do some stuff, look for things to do. Where the? There he is. I'm like, what the heck? Why did his little thing go away? He was lost. Tiny little legs. Couldn't climb up the vines. Huh. Magic cockerel. Magic Cockerel. Okay, let's talk to him. Behold, co -co -co! Behold, it is I, the Magic Cockerel. <laughs> Be not frightened by my splendor. <laughs> Ask him if he knows he has a son. <laughs> I'm not even gonna try to reading that. Magic. Okay, I'm gonna try. Magic Cockerel, tell him you're impressed. Ask him how he came by his powers. Raise a skeptical eyebrow. A magic cock herald. Is he? Hmm. I'm skeptical. That's right, Coco! Doubt will serve you ill before the magic cock roll. I <laughs> meant no offense. None to talk to. Oh, good. Ask him if he knows he has a son. Do you know uh, you have a son? I should certainly hope so. Oh. For my life's work has been for naught. <laughs> Send the Take little brook my way next time you happen upon him. I'd like to see what a fine specimen the magic cockroach has produced. Hmm. I'm impressed. Kill the w -w wizard. Huh? Ah, oh, so I guess he's okay. That was really strange, but I love it. What's with... The little chicken coop was dancing. Why did it do that? Now it's not dancing. Huh. I'm not gonna attack. I'll use. Huh. That was strange. But okay. Okay. Where are we? I thought we were going this way. But we're not. Oh, well, then let's go this way. <gasps> Another yellow thing. I must talk to it. I must. This looks like an elven proving ground, but I've never seen one for myself. Elven proving ground. The heck is. <gasps> oh, it's so beautiful. Look at this thing. Hero of winter. Oh. oh, should I take a screenshot? I don't know if I'd be able to use this as a thumbnail, but... I, should I... I did it. <laughs> I did it. Alright, <laughs> let's talk to it. See if it says the something. The totem is still <gasps> and silent. Okay, it doesn't say anything. Hmm. There's a thing here. Where is it? I don't see it. Oh, there it is. Damn it. Stop moving. Nice to have some squeaking elves around here again. They always put on such a show at those big old heads. Kaboom! Splash! Sizzle! Very excited. Little fella. Oh, there's another one! Ooh. XP. Oh, that's a lot of XP. Well, then. Is there four of them? Yeah, there's right there. Is there another one over here? There is! Oh, he's doing a jig! 
Yeah. Yeah, dance. Dance for me. All right. <laughs> Let's take a... I want to take some screenshots here. Let's get... Uh, you might see this on the next thumbnail. I don't know. If I can manage to get this stuff off. This is pretty cool. Gotta get the perfect angle. There we go. Perfectly centered. Get the mouse out of the way. And then... Hiya! Perfect. Beautiful. So beautiful. Yes. <laughs> okay, they, I'm gonna... Oh, that was a little weird. Oh, yeah. Yeah, center. Center perfect. Sorry if this is a, a little weird for you. I just... It's so nice. Really? They've done a good job. Perfect. All of them have been taken of the picture. What's this? I see you. Oh. But you are no elf. This place is not for you. Its trial is not for you to attempt. Say that you'd like to prove yourself as a friend of the elves. Growl that you won't be denied. Remark that you don't care about any trial and take your leave. I want to be friends. <laughs> Very well. You may face the trial. Yes! Say that you're ready to begin. Say that you want to hear what this trial entails first. Say that you want to know who or what you're speaking to. Hmm. Hmm. Who am I speaking to? I am the voice of the fire. My flame bears the will of all elves and lights the way for those who wish to prove their mettle. Huh. What uh, are the tra trials about? You shall learn all that you need to know. Show patience. I'm patient. Elves know that nature is a finer weapon than even the sharpest blade. Ah. The four seasons have served our people well. Four heroes rest before you, wielders of the seasons. Pay homage to their skills. Solve their riddle. Oh no. And prove yourself worthy of elven respect, if you can. Riddles? Oh, <laughs> I suck at riddles. Winter shudders with oh. ice and snow. Autumn rumbles, the sky lit aglow. Summer burns, air fiery as a hearth. <laughs> Spring quenches with bloody rebirth. Okay. Huh. So, I think, uh, all of these, what are they called? Hero totems, statue things? I think that they, uh, let's see, winter shutters with ice and snow. So, I think I need to, like, do some ice magic on this. And then, sky lit a glow. Autumn rumbles. Oh, the autumn one, I think, is this one? Uh, uh, lightning? Summer burns, air fiery as a hearth. Summer burn. Oh, wait, no, is this one summer? Or is this one summer? No, this one's summer. Or is it the one behind me? Can I rotate? Yes, I can. Spring. No, this one looks more like summer. And this one is fire. And spring quenches with bloody rebirth. And this one's blood. Blood rain. I don't have that. That. Okay, take your leave. Huh? I. Uh. That was, that was an accident. Hmm. Okay. Let's see. You have ice, don't you? <gasps> it's doing a thing. Oh. Ha uh ha. -huh. Okay. This one, autumn. Oh shoot, that's lightning, right? I uh, don't have. Ah, uh, do I want to waste this? No, no, no. Have them do this. No, no. Get closer. Eh? Uh, I think it worked. It's staying like that, so I think that's good. 
Ah, oh, summer. This one's summer. Okay, so that one was fire. That is Fane's thing. Let's see. Uh, where's the thing? Oh, you can do the thing, right? <laughs> I can't, I say thing a lot. I've noticed. The thing. Where the heck is your mask? Oh my gosh, I have terrible vision. All right, lizard. I thought I had like arrows, but oh, it's right there. Shoot! I, like I said, I have terrible vision. Uh, get out of my way, guys! I want to burn you. Hmm? Hmm? I don't think that worked. Summer. Okay, maybe I should do this one. Okay, something's not right. Archived. No, wait, no, 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 no. Dialogues. Uh. Oh, no. Oh, should it be the last one, right? Yeah. Summer. Air. Air. Fiery as a hearth. Yeah. It's not doing any special... Uh-oh. Wait a minute, this one's not doing anything special either. <laughs> I'm screwing everything up! Hold on. I'll at the bottom. Am I supposed to do this? Skylit glow. This is the only one that's doing a thing. Aw, oh, man. Am I gonna have to waste this? I will waste this. Don't you screw me. Hmm. <sighs> like I said, I am uh, not good at puzzles. Hmm. One last try. Do I talk to it after each one? I see you. The trial remains incomplete. Winter shudders with ice and snow. Autumn rumbles. The sky lit aglow. Summer oh. burns. Yeah. Air fiery as a hearth. We did that. Spring quenches with bloody rebirth. Right, right. Uh... This is the only one that's doing a thing. And I just wasted a... Talk now. I just wasted a sweet scroll. Alright, one more time. If this doesn't work, I'm quitting. No. Can I... Let me see. Yeah, yeah, I'm quitting. Can't do it. I don't know what the heck I'm doing. I give up. I tried it. I'm sure someone, you guys will know what's up. I, I don't know. I'm not good at riddles. I suck at this. I give up. Stupid trial. Man, what the heck did he do that? Now it's gonna haunt me forever. Go no further. We are at ritual. Do not disturb us. Hmm. Mention that you'd like to see the ritual. Strength, human. Tell the elf to stand aside before you knock him aside. Finesse, human. Smile and tell the elf there's no need to be so defensive. You mean no harm. Memory, human. Say that you have gravely important matters to attend to and must be allowed to pass. Take a leave. I mean no harm. Son of a B word. <laughs> it's not really a swear word anyway, but still. I think that's my first failure. The elf shakes his head slowly. His eyes fixed upon you with a stare of a hunter. Uh-oh. This place is not for you. 
leave. <laughs> Sybil! Talk to them for me, please. Go no further. We are at ritual. Do not disturb us. Hmm. I'm gonna ignore these because this one says Sybil and this one says Elf. And I've said before that I would do what uh, most pertains to them. So, Constitution is Sybil. Respond to the guard with the traditional elfin greeting and say that you wish to he to bear witness to the ritual. Elf, tell the elf to relax. Your kin, after all, you mean no harm. Well, let's go with CB. Ha ha! Yes, we're amazing! Thank you, Sybil! Your tongue betrays you, sister. You spend too much time with humans. But you may enter. <laughs> yes! Circuit. What did he do? Wood to wood, birth to birth. Is there something gonna happen? They look nice. They're all fancy. <laughs> they're they're acting as if they're embarrassed for me watching. Um, should we continue? I don't know. Oh my gosh. I guess they're not gonna continue. Let's have Sybil talk to them. I don't think they want to talk to me. Or oh, we can't talk to them? What's going on? Three battle-weary elven warriors make ritual over the body of a fallen comrade. They're chanting low and fierce. The pain of their losses manifest in every word. Blood to earth, to wood, to birth. The blood of Sarius to this earth. All elf. Whisper the refrain, blood to earth. Offer a prayer to Tyr Sendelius for the repose of Sarius' soul. Hold your tongue. You know not this Sarus. Hmm. Hmm. I have no idea what Sybil would say. So I guess I'm left for this decision to make on my own. And I think uh, she should be silent. The tallest, strongest elf, whom Maybe. you take to be the leader, gives you a disapproving look, <laughs> then turns away. I uh, pooped it up. She places the tip of a long-bladed spear on poor dead Sarius's chest bone. Blood to earth. Her companions reach out and grasp the spear, ready to plunge it into Sarius's heart. No. Oops, wrong button. Uh, reach out too and grasp the spear. I, I guess so. Blood to earth. Together you plunge the blade deep into Sarius's heart, then twist it three times as is the custom. Blood flows freely to the ground, and Sarius's heart lies neatly cut in four. <gasps> what? Blood to blood. This. Each warrior plucks a piece of heart and places it in their mouth. Chewing solemnly, their leader looks to you to see what you will do. With great respect, take a piece of heart, put it in your mouth, and chew. Nod your head respectfully, but do not eat the flesh. Eat the flesh, Sybil. Eat the flesh. Saria's memories flood you. A warrior, proud and true, you fight the lone wolves at the sawmill for Sahela, your scion, and for the future of all the elves, or all that still remain. But the fight goes ill. You and Tova draw fire that your friends may flee. You die in Tova's arms. <gasps> Give Tova a slow nod of respect. You share a memory now. Keep still and hide the fact that you think Tova let her comrade die. They share a memory. With the barest blink, Tova accepts your good wishes, then turns back to the corpse. Sarius is a warrior, proud and true. Blood to blood, earth to earth, wood to wood, birth to birth. Sarius becomes his tree. May Sarius take root. The oh. elves pick Sarius's bloody corpse from the ground. Tova looks to you. Then, after a moment's Whoa. thought, indicates for you to help. Together you send Sarius to his final resting place. Oh yeah, XP. His corpse rolls to Whoa. a stop at the bottom of the pit. The elven leader stands and stares at her fallen comrade. 
Then she wipes away a tear and turns away. Ha ha! Level 11. No one has a staff in my party. Two handed mace. Not as good as mine. Uh, uh, they all suck. I guess I'll take this. Wow, that was interesting. So they planted an elf tree. Is this in the shape of a person? It kind of is. That's super cool. The moment all wow. are fit and fighting is the moment we take the mill. Well, that was interesting. I pray that moment comes. I guess keep talking. I see the good in you. <laughs> I don't know about civil, but okay. Ask the shaman for whom the elves are in ritual. We are in ritual for our comrade Sarius. Dead at the hand of a lone wolf. Wait, one wolf? Oh, that's, that's pretty sad. Offer your condolences for the loss of Sarius. Ask why a lone wolf, wolf, wolf would have killed him. Yeah, really, that's what I was thinking too. If you would talk of lone wolves, you must talk to Tova. Okay. Who's Tova? Take oh. heart, my friend. The tall elf dead. stares into the pit with dry, bloodshot eyes, her face betraying no emotion. Mm -hmm. We lose too much. We lose our homes. We lose our safety. We lose each other. Mm. She looks into your eyes, her face set in a fierce frown. It is enough. No more. Nod. Your power... Power. Your people have suffered too much. Far too much. Yes. It is as though Tyrus and Dilius himself forgets us. There is no fate for us but the one we make. You honor us during the ritual. You honor Sarius. You help remember him. You help bury him. Mm -hmm. But we need help still, huh? or we perish here. Not only these people here, but all of us. I wonder if you honor us once more. Ask what she needs. Say you might, but your service comes with a fee. Tell her you oh, tell her you stumbled upon her ritual by mistake. You don't have time to linger. Oh, that's me. Uh Jeez, what the heck would Sibyl say about this? Uh, 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 what she needs. It is something of great importance to me and to our people. Our home forests are gone. The great trees are cut to pieces. The memories inside them nearly lost. They become nothingness unless we find our scion. Hmm. All right. All right. So these two are my only options. You've heard of scions before. They are like seeds containing all elvish memories. A safeguard against the destruction of the ancestor trees. Elf, express your concern. A scion has been lost? Elf? I guess. Not lost. Taken. All our memories. Everything the ancestor trees knew. Our seed for the future. Stolen from us. She... She is... Gone? Her voice catches in her throat. She is my daughter. Oh. Her name is Sahela, and she yeah. is taken from us. Wait a that minute. That is why we come here. That is why we lose Sarius, to find her. If she is lost, if our scion is lost, all our people are lost. She is everything. Sahelia. Oh, that's... Oh, no, it's my chest. Oh, my gosh. I, oh, we have to go back and get the necklace. Oops, go back. It, we, this is her people. We have her the necklace. Her eyes narrow, her fists clench, and her mouth tightens to a thin line. Yes. Do you know the lone wolves? Not. Say you've heard of a savage group of mercenaries who go by that name. Say you haven't. Oh, I haven't been messed with would have been bad news here because he's uh, one of them. Right? I think so. Yes. 
Savage is just right. They care for gold, not life. Sahela is taken to Fort Joy, and the wolves steal her from there. Steal her from there? But she is strong. She is calm. She sees so much. Too much for one so young. We come here to get her back. To bring her home. She is everything to me. She is everything to us. Say you'll try to find her. Ask for an inf ask for any information that might help. Insist you cannot help her. She will have to find her daughter on her own. Tell her it was you that saved Amiro. You are the one. We come because of you. I thank you. But the lone wolves take her before we are there. Wait, wait a minute. That was me. I, I saved her. It was me. You speak to her. Sybil you in understand. The face. You see what a gentle soul she is. You see how kind. She's all right. She is not only a scion, but a precious child. She cannot be lost. Say you'll f try to find her. Okay. We've read this. Hmm. We'll try to... We'll, we'll, we'll help. We'll help. You honor us. Yes. I fear it is impossible for one of my kind to enter their base. They know we are here. They expect us. But you have been away from the tribes. It is in your speech. It is in the way you walk. Perhaps you have a chance still. She is taken by their leader, a savage man named Roost Anlon. Hmm. I do not know why, but I know she must return to me. If I lose her, I cannot lose her. We plan another assault. We cannot give up. It is better for us all to die than for Sahela to be lost. I only hope perhaps you find her before then. Good luck. <sighs> wow, this is some mighty story being revealed. We have Sahel's necklace, but it's in my storage chest. So we're going to go back and get that and return. Maybe get some more XP. Look at that, so close. Uh, and level up one day soon. Mm, also... What I forgot to do before we end this episode is that we need to make a mask. And now I know which mask I want to make. Uh, uh, this one? And because... Mm -mm, where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Grimoire? No, no, no. It's armor. Armor? Yes. All right. Lizard human. We're going to make a human mask. Maybe no, no, no. Wait. This mask is gonna be for Sibyl because they. She said that elves or just this elf won't be allowed in there, so this might come in handy. So let's do that. Let's combine. I know I'm probably wasting a source orb, but <gasps> oh, excuse me, I just hiccuped. There, there you go. Inventory. Where is it at? Here it is. Turn it to human. Doesn't look like... Alright, alright. Let's test it out. Let's see. CBU. Let's walk over here so that nobody attacks us for doing magic. I don't know. Might happen. Let's see. Where... Oh, it's right here. Uh-huh. Equip. She can transform too. No way. That's sick. I love it. Let's see. Ah. Oh, <laughs> that's her face. <laughs> okay, that's cool. Alright, so if we need to sneak in a place and not have an elf, we have someone or an equipment, a helmet that could do that for us. Freaking amazing. 
But, uh, all right, that's it. That's uh, where I'm going to leave the episode off. And, uh... Oh, hmm. Mm. You know what? Do we have time? I mean, mm. all right, you know what? I want to do that thing to end this quest really quickly. Uh, this button. Uh, the Lady Vengeance. It's not too far away. Then we're gonna go downstairs. Right here. Oh, the kid's back. Chest. Where is it at? Oh, it's here, right here. Right here. Right now? Oh. This one? Not even close. Can I click on the... No. Oh my gosh. Okay. Alright. Uh, how am I gonna post... How am I supposed to find this place? Somewhere over here. It's over here. Here we go. Boom. Can I click? I think it's here. Oh, here we go. Whew. Let's see, inventory. Yep, this is the one. Give this to these guys. And she still has this equipped. Ha! Oh, wait, there's one right there. Oh, and us, we're just. Oh my gosh, that's where we just uh, came from. Where the heck are they? There they are. Now let's see if we can give them this necklace. We should have a uh, Sibyl carry it. Let's see. Uh, who did we have to talk to? It started with a T, right? Tova. Please, hurry. Anything you can find out. Anything you can do to bring her home. Hmm. Once all are well, I see the good in you. No. I see the good in you. You may see the good in me, even injured. Oh, what about you? I see you. I see the God in you, ask her. She can. So. Huh. Is it you? you may take the I mill see without. You. The ritual is complete. Sarius is inside us and the earth. Speak with Tova. I see you. <laughs> I see you. I see the good in you. Pass freely. God, that was a waste. All right, I'm ending the episode here. Oh, my gosh. All right, thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. And I'll see you on the next one. Bye. The moment all Bye. are fit and fighting 